connecting with us via Facebook. We greet everyone in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And we bless God for his presence in this place. Let's go back to that the Lord to be with us in this manner. Hallelujah. And I want us to go straight to the word, Pastor Wani. And as I was praying, this morning, Unendo Echele Trizwenyam, Eti, and Tanda Zilu, Uba Uba Sus.
food. Simwali is a Kosiam this morning. Sipil is a Nalo Kosi this morning. Put things into perspective through your word this morning. Clear out the mist in front of us through your word this morning. David says, Your word is like a lamp unto my feet. And this morning, Siti Malikani says, Renako, Pamikwe, Tungeta, Malika Jesu. We thank you, Jesus. We submit this morning fully and wholly under the authority of your word. Minister through your word. Encourage through the power of your word. Believe that as we lako, motivate, correct. Paramisa, Fusitemba, yes, we lako, get a man, yes, amen. This chapter, it's a high priestly prayer. Um, that was made with this, I, I guess it's called a high priestly prayer because it was made by our high priest which is Jesus Christ hallelujah and we explain now he prays for a number of things for the disciples and those that are to believe in the word and the message of the disciples if you read this chapter you will understand that this prayer was not only made for the disciples that were in front of him or the, or the saints or the Christians that believed in the message during his time at the time. Hallelujah. But he continues to say, I don't only pray for them, but I also pray for those who will believe in their message. And he prays for a number of beautiful things. And one of them is unity. He says, you and I are one and I pray that they may also be one. And he prayed for us to love one another. He says, I pray that they may love one another so that the world will know that you have sent me. Yeah. Uniform yet, but our uniform is love. No matina, sing I will be black and white, sing I will be red and white, sing I will be purple and white. Hallelujah. But the uniform that must be found in our midst, the Lord prayed that it may be love. And he also continues to pray, because the glory that you have glorified me with, I pray that you also glorify them. We are the generation that is supposed to love to walk and to live in the glory of God. When Isaiah says, arise and shine for the glory of the Lord is upon you, he talks to us. And, but one of the things which I think no one is really interested in this prayer or one of these prayer items is Kayesu, is when he says, Lord, I don't pray that you remove them from the world. I pray that you keep them. Because all of us, we want to pray. We pray that God must remove our troubles. But we are scooting. I don't pray that you remove them. I pray that you, sus you keep them in the midst of those troubles. Hallelujah. And when I looked at this word, keep, I pray that you keep them. I pray that you keep them and protect them. Hallelujah. You keep them and protect them from the evil one, even though because Usatana is the prince of this world. has been tested. Nobody is a survivor. 
That's why he says, where no one's a mask, we um, find an end or they are kept as what one. When the storms come, when the rains come, when the winds come, when floods come, they will hit all the houses. Some of the houses will fall and collapse, but when you will remain standing. My God. Oh, yes, Lord. And you see him, that he has confidence in his product. He also used his product as a transport to this world. Oh, Lord. Jesus. Remember, he was there in the beginning, Christ City. Let us make a man according to our own image. And the same God, he used the same man as a transport, as a vehicle to minister and to account. We tell me he brought a tiak. When a jab was shed on the hour, we brought a tiak. I would tell me. Jesus, my God. That's why you think of a conversation, Yak and Satan, about who job, who did him tell me in the way you In fact, to think of who was Satan, who don't call it a noun called Wam. For whom the call to teach of is a trusted and a reliable product. Who don't call it a noun called Wam? Ten begging, not a ten yet. In the year, I hear one called. Yes. Of 
glory. But no one wants to take the bitter cup. Verse 15, tell us a motto. If you continue, verse 20, 21, and 22, would I pray that you glorify them? Everyone wants to walk in glory. Everyone wants to be, wants to move You know, in course, must prepare the table in the presence of my enemies. But no one wants to walk through the valley of the shadow of death. All of us want to take another route around the shadow of death. So the creeps, the sister Jaffa and Pablo Java said, Uganda Yami and Halo Bazaran, in Kelly Hula in the valley of the shadow of death, well, at all, will in the way, the hour of glory. But we are so, and I tell her, a crown of thorns, he wouldn't have been having the crown of glory. Who chose the Emma Kulaka, a throng way, the Emma Kulaka would be trial. Why am I so? I don't pray that you remove them. I pray that you keep them. El Gabinete keep also keep also, also means to preserve. I pray that you preserve them. Don't remove them, but preserve them. Say as strong preservatives, those are products that you use in order to keep a particular product from expiring or under from uh, from buying a body. Hallelujah. And you apply certain products or you mix it with certain products so that you can extend the life shelf of that product. Tina, the farmers are tetuan on that. The farmers are tetuan on the misiet. The farmers are tetuan on a bantu on a bed. God, I couldn't preserve the teeth. Yeah. 
And I'm trying to want to tell you, please look at me. And I want to tell you whatever question you have, this is Jesus' reply to you today. We are but you I I I you do not realize now what I am doing, but later you will understand. Any version, it is for now. It is any version. Do not make any version. Jesus replied. Yes. You do not understand. You now. do not understand now. What I'm going. What I'm. What I'm doing. What I am doing in your life. But someday you will. But someday you will understand. Jesus answered and yes. said unto him, mm. What shall I do, though no is not now? Yes. Thou shalt know hereafter. Yeah, I will go to Shakespeare. Jesus, <laughs> <laughs> Shakespeare. It is Jesus answered and said to him, Yes. What I am doing, you do not understand. You do not understand. But Lord, let me tell you something. Not everything. In other words, we explain that way. He doesn't bother to explain. He doesn't explain what he is doing to them. Because not everything that happens to you needs you to understand or you need a logical explanation. The only thing that you need to understand and take comfort in is that way Nahuamba, the ancient of days. Is that when we have an end order that has promised that we have a twala back? We have no alpha, we have no omega. No more understanding. I'm telling you, God, when I want to assure you, be assured and take comfort in this. When we have the creator of the universe. Jesus. Oh, it's only for me. I'll tell you. Billions of galaxies are formed. Seven are not known. Now, that you have understand it, God will take comfort. You have a long one, you cheat a man, and they worry. And you try to get them by when you pay this cheat. I put full a corner, I can't do it for life. The Lord said, I must tell you, for now you don't understand, but later you will. How many things have we gone through in our lives? When at the time you were going through as a situation, you were like, I think God hates me or God has forgotten me. I don't understand what's going on in my life. But later in your life, and you like, when you look back in your life, and you're like, okay, now I see why I had to go through it. And that's exactly what God says in this place. Today you don't understand. But someday you will. Tell us begin your sentences. Oh, tell now. Oh, so we twilight. 